What's up guys, it's Ryan, and today I'm gonna tell you the story of how I became a YouTuber with just a thousand subscribers. Now, I know what you guys are thinking. You only have a thousand subscribers. You're not a YouTuber, a thousand, not a lot. And well, my response to that is, a thousand subscribers is a lot. That's a lot of people. Now just imagine having a thousand people at your house. That's insane. Okay, but in all seriousness, when I say that I'm a YouTuber, I mean it in the sense that I work for this channel right here. Coulter 35, which is run by the mysterious and highly elusive Anthony Manella. If you don't know Coulter 35, it's a fast-growing, debatably underrated channel that makes comedy skits. Think prime Nickelodeon shows like Drake and Josh, iCarly, Victorious, and then just remove all of the television success, professional sets and funding, and just throw in a couple average looking guys and then boom, that's us. As for how I got here, well, let me give you the short version. We were friends in high school. Okay, yeah, I know that's super boring, so let me just give you a little more details. I only made a few videos with Anthony in high school before I disappeared for four years to fight crime as a superhero. Okay, yeah, that's not true. The truth is we lost touch for a little while after high school, and in that time I got a retail job, quit because I was miserable, got my dream job working for my Taekwondo school, in which I basically made no money at all. Next thing I know, business is booming. I start making good money, reconnect with Anthony and start making some videos again, and life is pretty great. And then, global pandemic. My Taekwondo school shuts down, I now have no job, I'm unemployed, and I'm just sitting at home going insane. So, I used that time to pour all of my efforts into content creation with Anthony, and that's pretty much how I got here. So now I co-write every video, I'm an actor, and I learn how to edit, all of which led me to creating my own channel. It's so crazy to come to terms with the fact that I'm a YouTuber. I mean, I never would have seen myself becoming one. I'm super introverted, I had an emotionally rough childhood that made me unable to express myself properly, and somehow, with all of that, I still became an actor. And it really makes no sense to me. I mean, I don't even think I'm funny or good at acting, but I am improving. But above all else, I think my writing is where I stand out the most. Some of the videos, or as I like to call them, episodes that I've written, have gotten millions of views. And I like to think that makes me pretty dang good at writing. And it's those successes that make me feel like I'm able to call myself a YouTuber. Even if I only have just a thousand subscribers on my own channel. Which, by the way, a thousand is still a lot. Let's remember that. A thousand is a lot of people, even if it's not a lot by YouTube standards. A thousand is a lot. Well guys, that's it for this one. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed this kind of storytelling video and I hope that at least some of it made sense. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you enjoyed it. And if you didn't like the video, then just like the video if you love puppies.